2,000 years ago, so the locals say, this crumbling structure was an observation post for Berbers on the lookout for invading Roman armies. Today, it's a lookout for a whole new war. Rebel fighters watching over the Gaddafi-held city of Tiji, a few kilometres away. Rebels have it sealed off on three sides, from the fourth to the northeast, Tripoli. The rebels are calling Tiji, the town behind me, a gateway city. That's because they say if they take that and the nearby town of Bada to the east, then there's going to be very little standing between them and the doorstep of Tripoli. But talking about taking TG and actually achieving it are different things. Rockets arrive daily from the city and into the nearby town of Kabal. But rebels are not returning fire at the moment. That's because when they advanced on the city and engaged Gaddafi troops in a fierce firefight earlier this week, they saw families, including women and children, running into houses, and so they withdrew. This situation we're facing uh, uh, a big problem because uh, Gaddafi forces and Gaddafi machineries used the uh, people and the civilian people as a human shield. That's a claim we can't independently verify, but it is clear that after making significant gains last week, seizing half a dozen towns beneath the Nafusa Mountains, the advance here has stalled at this key city. Rebels say they've gotten word to the remaining residents to leave, and leave soon. We go in, but we try as we can, you know, to avoid the civilian people. But we should be go, you know, because the, we give them the, 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 the chance. During our visit to this observation post, anti-aircraft fire, ineffective from this distance, could be heard coming from the city. Zambu says he likes that sound. It is, he said, the sound of Gaddafi fighters wasting ammunition. And this is as close to the front line as we'll get today. The rebel commander we're with says if we drive down that road, we will be seen by Gaddafi forces and they will open fire on us and on his men. With the prize that is TG so clearly in their sights, the rebels say it won't be long before they're firing back again. Michael Holmes, near TG, Western Libya.